I did see someone say in chat, <clears throat> I hope NL saw the, the Heinz Craft Singles thread on Reddit today. It was a, a, a symphony of Redditor essays plus hailing corporate. I don't, I did not see it. We're going to try a little laser dome, of course, today. I did not see it, but I would love to know more about it. Jumping is useless. Hold on, I'm lowering the volume slightly. Repellent, laser, mist, repellent, shield, shield, shield. Repellent is just so good, man. It's just so good. It's just so good. Ah, but you know what? Shield is kind of good too. I'm gonna I'm gonna try it like this first. Oh, by the way, I'm stupid. Start a prediction. Will we break 500 points? Yes, no. I'm gonna give you five minutes for that one because the game starts a little slow sometimes, and then we'll begin. <clears throat> Send me down. Donkey. Donk. Uh, this, we've got bronze squares. I would classify that personally as um, mildly bullish. And we're, we didn't get a teleporter yesterday. We're hoping we get a teleporter today. Malfa was one wave away from beating your score and then got smoked. Okay, well, you know what? The Atlanta Falcons were one quarter away from uh, beating the New England Patriots in the Super Bowl. We all know what happened there. That's why you don't bet against Tom Brady until he crosses the age of 44. And then you, you exclusively bet against Tom Brady. Broncos country? Let's ride. Broncos country? Let's ride. See, I'm familiar with the memes. What did we do to deserve current football references? They started playing uh, Thursday Night Football on Twitch. So now I can make fun of the Bears and the Banks. I can make fun of the, the Bears and the Washington football team. Which still, they gotta... Uh, listen. Hold on. I mean, we need, we need some drill speed. Then there's a part of me that... Uh, I'm like, laser... You know what? I'm gonna go psycho mode. I'm going laser power. Oh, they are the commanders now. Sorry, my mistake. I'm like way out of out of time with this. I forgot they were commanders. It's not a horrible name. I think it just takes some time sometimes to, you know, come to terms with it. Two of these? Wow. Please tell me your team is the Bills or the Giants. No, worse, I'm a Seahawks fan. And it, it's not like I have nothing... I, I, I didn't grow up being a Seahawks fan, although I never had anything against Sean Alexander, Matt Hasselbeck, um, etc., etc. But I just live in... Um, I live in the Pacific Northwest, so as a result, I am a Seahawks fan. But I don't watch football, so I'm not going to pretend like that... I, oh, it's been such a hard season for Seahawks fans. But I will say it's crazy... Like, when we go visit our in-laws in the U.S., if you'll forgive the, you know, using the, the sledgehammer of rhetoric here, football really is a religion down there. Like, when you're, you're driving, you go by people's houses, and, like, one in 20 houses have, like, Seahawks logo mailboxes and stuff like that. And people are just, like... Rocking like the football jerseys in public is like what you wear on for your Sunday best. Like it's it's wild, man. I'm not gonna say it doesn't exist to an extent in Canada, but but to a much lesser extent, I would say. I'm at work right now wearing a Bills jersey. See, I'm I'm not knocking it in the slightest. I'm just saying it. <clears throat> for all I know, it could be the same in the UK. Congrats on your 200th Peloton ride. Excuse me. Today was my 300th Peloton ride. My 200th Peloton ride was in it was on June 9th, apparently, according to Twitter. That was pre I almost died era. Can you believe it? We've come a long way. I need more squares. I need more squares. I need more carrying capacity. Thank you so much. And I thank you. Should probably only take three, but I'm taking this many. 
It's pre-food poisoning arc. It's true. Help me. Help me. It is crazy, though. It's like... I, I, my first Peloton ride, I'm pretty sure it was November, like, 21st or 22nd, 2021. We should be smarter. Let's, let's get Wave Timer. Yeah, that, that saved me from probably getting hurt there. Um, so it's been, there's something like 300 rides in, like, I don't know. 325 days which especially considering the food poisoning was was pretty sick now there are the occasional days that were um two 15 minute rides instead of one 30 minute ride that pumps the numbers slightly but then there's also some days that were uh one 45 minute ride instead of one 30 minute ride so you know there's a there's a little bit of column a and a little bit of column b Hey, Samantha Panther, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Much appreciated. I can't believe it's Friday. <clears throat> Are you ever going to make bespoke Dome Keeper videos for YouTube again? Dome Keeper is a hard thing to do on YouTube right now. I'm saving water for, for gadgets. Because, like, Relic Hunt is, like, it's fun. Don't get me wrong, but it doesn't feel like the, the canonical form of the game anymore. And prestige mode is like two and a half hours long sometimes, which is literally like the entire length of the time that I have to record videos on a daily basis at most. So it's like it, it, it's kind of in a, an awkward position. Also, uh, like my whole family, except me, has been sick for like a week. So there's been a lot of the, the work time in that afternoon era has been at a premium. Forget jetpack speed. No, get jetpack speed. Our laser's fine. Get jetpack speed. Get, um, up upgrade your shield. Get invulnerability, because I love it. I'm okay with that. Hey, and Zebra68, thanks for the gifted subscriptions as well. Thank you. Someone on Reddit said you won't play scary games because you're a pants peer. Is that true? I was talking about it, actually, in the cool content creator discord this morning i realize it's not really that i get scared like i really like horror movies and stuff like that it's more so that um the the way that uh horror games are marketed is like look at how scary this is and then um like when you play it you're like oh i can't wait to be scared and then 75 percent of the game is trying to find four uh, gears to fit into an old furnace and then trying to orient the gears properly in order to turn it on so that it'll open like an old gate or something like that and then when you open the old gate like a little rat scurries by and you're like oh no that's nemesis so like it's not really that I'm afraid of being afraid on camera it's that I, I just like hate quote unquote puzzles that much I really do I honestly, I'm going second in vulnerability. The haters amongst us will say, I always lose because I overinvest in, in gadgets first, and I should be investing in my econ. What do the haters know, anyway, except for the fact that they're usually, like, right? And Creep Air, thank you for the gifted subscriptions as well. Thank you. <clears throat> When's the last time you peed your pants? I don't know. It's been a while. Thanks to the, the food poisoning, I probably crapped my pants more recently than I peed my pants. There was, there was a long streak where that was not the case, for sure. Get this smoked, if you'll excuse me, if I could just... Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna get our auto and vulnerability. Coming back, I don't even have a health bar. I don't have a rook anymore! Okay. <clears throat> what caused you to lose your mind in the last sap video? Bro, why are people so boring? See people see someone having fun? This guy's definitely whoa. There must have been like a approximate cause for this one. Just it's just it's just in a bit of a silly mood. What's the what's the problem? 
this guy's going, whoa, is that second coffee this morning? You know, like it's just sometimes you're just in a, you're just in a mood, man. So people who hear a song by like, they hear like radioactive by Imagine Dragons and they're like, whoa, what were these guys on when they made this? Well, they're probably on drugs, but not when they write their songs. Maybe when they, you know, perform or like after the show. I don't know. Maybe they're straight edge. I don't want to slander them. <laughs> I'm just... This kid is definitely on crack right now. So true. Yes. Yes. Okay, we need we need some laser speed. I feel like we've done okay so far. Obviously, we do only have five points, but... Honest, uh, and I don't, I'm not sure if this is going to get plus twos or minus twos. If your music sucks, you better be sober. Because you haven't earned the right to, um... I was gonna say have fun. But that's not... I don't want to push a pro-drug message necessarily. <laughs> like... <laughs> if, if you're on uh, mind-expanding chemicals and you write shit that is boring, then you should go to rehab and like get clean because it's not making a difference in your artistic output you might as well have the healthiest possible life that you could i want that for you okay <clears throat> i hate to mine so deep but uh, this is just it's substrate driven mining right now i mean we get the next level of drill speed we can afford to get into the deeper uh or uh, into the the right side there a little No offense to the fans of Imagine Dragons. Songs to drive your car really fast to? If you mine like this in uh, Dome Keeper, you better be sober. I'm stone sober. I am, th there's not a, a, a drop of mind-altering chemical inside of me except for one cold brew coffee. And it was actually like, um, it wasn't even like one cold brew. It was like 65% of a cold brew because that was all that was left in the fridge. So I'm, li I'm actually like, I'm more sober than usual if you consider caffeine to be a, uh, a hallucinogen, in which case, I mean, I don't know what to tell you. CM Punk. Go, 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 go. You ever try MDMA? Nope. Basically, none of them. That was fast in vulnerability. You know what? We could use second level of shield. Hey, 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 hey. Basically, none of them. I've had a beer before in my life. I've had some glucose. I've had some caffeine. Any, any drug, though, that's like an acronym, I have not had. If you're like, if you're like, if you ever had uh, the chiral form of DMT, I'm like, nah, man, I haven't even had like the original form of DMT, the spirit molecule. That's true. I have had a few IPAs, so maybe that's like, uh, not today, but just in general. Maybe I'm putting on airs. Bro, there's gotta be, you know there's some, this is a fallacy, this is the appeal to substrate fallacy, but you know there's something good in here because it's so freaking thick. We should just get the gadget first. Please, I've been waiting so long for a teleporter. What's your thoughts on the legalization of uh, psychedelic mushrooms in BC to treat mental health such as PTSD? Bro, I'm not the guy. Like, I'm not a, <laughs> I'm not a, I'm not a, I'm not a doctor. I'm not a scientist. Oh, give me the stun laser. I'm not a, a military vet. I'm just a guy online, man. I don't know the answer to that question. That's that's too much. Sanest streamer. I just don't know, man. Oh, that's true. I was I was chock full of ciprofloxacin less than two months ago. I forgot about that part. This guy is trying to say he's drug free, yet he took took antibiotics to save his life this summer. Huh? 
How dare you? Gut flora altering drugs. And hey, they say that your gut is like your second brain. So I heard that a lot as I was dying. They were like, hey, just so you know, your gut's like your second brain. Cool. So you're functionally, you're saying like, I'm, I'm uh, going brain dead. I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot for your diagnosis. How about a health bar? Don't think we need it yet. Like we just got it. We've got a couple of spider webs here. No big deal. I feel like it, it, it does only cost one. I guess it could be a nice, uh, a nice additional thing to have. Water. Two waters. Still not a good tree triangle placement. But you know what this does give us? Early, early melee damage reduction plus multiplier or... Maybe just, uh, maybe two multipliers. Melee damage reduction, kind of sick with it, though. Uh, you know, okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna double my shield strength and give it time to charge. And then I'm going to get score. I still have three triangles. I'm gonna look to get melee damage reduction. I need one square to make that happen, to make that dream come true. That's psychotic. I apologize there. Congrats on the 300. Thank you, thank you. And the other thing, I didn't even want to mention it, but it was a good ride too. I think it was like a 376 kilojoule, 30 minute Sam Yo 90s pop ride. Busting my glutes to some uh, British boy bands, like Take That, that I've never heard of before in my life outside of Sporkle quizzes. Live in La Vida Loca. What about five? Oh, I, I know all about five. Baby, when the lights go out, every single word cannot express the love and tenderness. I'll show you what it's all about. And then the classic 90s boy band thing where you can't actually say anything sexual, but you can allude to it. Baby, say you will succumb to me. So baby, come to me when the lights go out. You're like, yo, he said come though? I lost. And now, what was your favorite Halloween costume as a kid? Straight up, as a child, I hated Halloween. Not, not, uh, that's not just me as an adult saying that. As a kid, I absolutely... I did not enjoy Halloween at all. <clears throat> I enjoyed salty snacks. I did not enjoy sweet snacks as much. Um, I lived in a very rural area where people didn't give out candy. Every house was like one kilometer away from the, the house beside it. Uh, and people gave out like homemade popcorn balls, which honestly is probably sick. I bet they tasted amazing. But as like a little kid, that's not what you want. Okay, we got to do this. And then we can, let's, let's get some melee damage reduction. And then we got five and three. That's a great way to do some, some gadget investment. Like, I didn't even mean to get that one. I keep doing that, but that's, we're going to want damage at some point. But I really wanted the, the fire endurance first, but whatever. <clears throat> Halloween was not my holiday. But now, yes, I, I've said it a few times before, but as a dad, I think Halloween has like way more... It was way more exciting for me because I get to see my kid in a cute costume and I get to wear a costume myself. But like, I, I, I'm, I don't enjoy the costume, but I'll debase myself to a huge degree for the enjoyment of my child, you know? I don't really want to put on a costume just to go to like a, hey, it's our Halloween party. It's on October 21st and it's just, uh, basically we're just going to get hammered and uh, wear wigs. Like I'll be scratching my scalp all the damn time. I, I'm sorry, I got to get you. But if, if it makes my kid happy to see me dressed as like Buzz Lightyear, then sure, then, I'll, then I'm Buzz Lightyear tonight. It wasn't that bad.
What weapon do you think they should add next? To Halloween? Oh, to Dome Keeper. To Dome. Oh, of course, to Dome. Oh, what a hilarious misunderstanding. Um, they should add a laser that works. They should add a sword. Wait, th those already taken? They should add, um, um, the, the, um, the, the, um, hand of God. Is that a, is that, they should add a gun? They should add a, a Glock? They should add a CZ? They should add a Mac 11. I did see uh, the, those videos, by the way. All the chess boxers are posting the videos of them in the gym. Listen, I'm not doing the chess boxing, which means I get to criticize from the peanut gallery. If, if I was in a celebrity boxing event, you would never see a progress video of me whatsoever. You would see me announce that I'm going to be in the event. Then I would disappear on social media, at least. And then I would show up at the event and I would either be uh, at the weigh in, I should say. I would either be so shredded that it would inspire fear in the hearts of the enemies, or it would be very clear very fast that I did not take it seriously. I would show up like pudgy and poorly conditioned, and they, were, they would be like, why did I waste time training so much? And they would knock me out in the first round. But I would never show my progress, because then you show your progress, the other person that you're boxing is going to be like, oh, I'm a little bit behind. And then they're going to work even harder. No, man. Let them, you know, erode their own motivation in their own head while you're letting, uh, you know, success be your advertisement. Always keep them guessing. Okay, hold on. I got, I got eight and one. Eight and one. Eight and one. Eight and one. I'd like more. I'd like to rush to dub laser if possible, but I'd also love jetpack speed because we're getting a little deeper into the mines here. Yeah, or like fake progress videos of me doing horrible, like completely unable to throw a punch. So please stop talking to me about the city of Buffalo. If you if you're just if you only saw the out of context clip of me making fun of Buffalo, you miss the first part of the clip, which is people from Buffalo acting like their city is a world class destination, <laughs> saying things like, "Wow, you never visited Buffalo, and you only lived." Five hours away? Yeah, I never visited Buffalo. I only lived five hours away. Why would I... And this is just an honest question. Ask yourself the same thing. Why would I visit Buffalo when instead I could, uh, I could go to Toronto, which is on the way? Why would... And, and alternatively, why would I... And again, this is going to sound rude, but like if you're coming from Ontario, why would you visit... And, and you're not from, like, western, southwestern Ontario, I guess. Why would you visit Buffalo over New York City with a limited amount of vacation time? You, obviously, you're going to prioritize New York. And if you just want to visit America, you go to Watertown. Maybe you go to Syracuse, okay? It's, I'm not a, I'm nothing against Buffalo. It's just it's not in a convenient location. You have to pass through a more noteworthy city just to get to it. Going to the outlets? This guy doesn't know about the outlets. Hey, guys, this guy doesn't know about the outlets. Did you know that previously they used to... Um, so, like, this is... I don't know if you guys watch a lot of YouTube video essays. They used to ship, like, you know, factory extras or, like, slightly... Uh, subpar goods to outlets and then sell them at a cheap discount now they um predominantly make bad clothes for outlets instead and then like they're, they're made bad on purpose so you're no longer getting at least this is from my understanding of it based on reading comments on the internet rather than getting like you know designer goods at a cheaper price you're getting like deliberately subpar goods at a cheaper price and you're just paying for the label which to some extent you're just paying for the label to begin with but like i mean this is like to the extreme i suppose really i'm one short i'm one short i'm one short okay yeah instead of getting designer goods you're getting designer bads 
That's a very good way to, to phrase it. Mostly because it's pithy and quite humorous. Go ahead, break my shield. It was perfect timing. We still broke the rock. Okay. Um, good timing on this one. Good invincibility. You two got to get toasted. We really need the dub laser. It's got to happen. Can you shoot, please? Thank you. How many toes you got? The normal amount. Ten? That sounds right. What's normal? Okay, look, I didn't mean normal in like an insulting way. I meant normal in like a... <laughs> In a, in, a, in a statistical way. As we both know, the mean number of toes that a person has is less than 10. So if anything, I'm actually a little bit over-toed. Is this true? It could be over 10. Some people have like... I feel like feet are like the most likely part of a person to be like a little bit messed up. Like, you'll occasionally someone will be like, check it out, I've got like an extra finger. But I feel like 25% of the population has like a foot thing. Not, not a Tarantino-esque one, but like, a, hey, check it out, like I've, I'm missing two toes or something like that. It's like, it's almost like, um, like when your body's being made, it's being made top to bottom by a 3D printer that's slowly running out of filament. When they get to the feet, they're like, nobody's worried about these. Just, just give it your best effort. Teleport me, please. Probe is worth it. Yeah, and we can still, we've got another gadget space. Probe is really good. Would you let a chatter lick your toes for a million dollars? Yeah, yeah, I'd probably do that. I, I, I think I'd probably go with that one, yeah. For a million bucks? Yeah, yeah. For a, for one million dollars. Yes, absolutely. I'm telling you, by the way, it's not worth it. I'm, I'm telling you this out of, like, your own self-interest. You're not going to get what you think you're going to get out of it. I mean, my shoes smell on the regular. And sometimes my shoes smell so bad, they make my socks smell bad, even though my socks are clean. Check your DMs. Well, if you're like a, an insanely wealthy freak, get in touch with David. I'm telling you, but, and don't, listen, this is going to sound, you could take this like in the, in the bad faith way. Don't waste our time. I've set my price. Don't send David an email that's like, I've got $5,000. No, that's not, I'm not going to do it for that. Again, it's not even worth the 5000 But let's not, you know, let's not waste each other's time. I'm willing to haggle, but not, not from a million down to 5000 So what's your bottom price? Have you ever negotiated before? I'm not going to answer that question. I'm not a big fan of negotiating, but that's not... <laughs> I don't think that's a, a question I should be answering, honestly. We don't, we don't have a ton of time here, so I'm just going to waste it all mining this out. $800,000 is my final offer. I'm willing to remortgage my house right now. With um, mortgage rates at their highest level since April 2002, I can't in good conscience, as your financial advisor, allow you to do that right now. Right, right, probe. I forgot we had the probe. I feel like you'd do it for a thousand. I definitely would not do it for a thousand. Great wave. Great wave. What if you were out and about in flip-flops? I, I don't go out and about in flip-flops. I'm not a sandal wearer. And if, if you are, that's fine. It's not a moral thing. I actually just find them uncomfortable. Which I know is the opposite of like the normal position that people wear them because they're comfortable. But for whatever reason, I always find them like... I, I would never go for a walk in sandals. After two hours, like something like the tendons in my feet are all crisscrossed. I 
I like a shoe. I'm a shoe guy, honestly. I like sandals, but slides are the way. I thought slides and sandals were the same thing, honestly. They're not? I, I didn't know. You're, I, I didn't, I'm learning a lot about shoes, you know? I only recently learned what Blundstones were, and now I have some. I'd really like to rush for that Power 3, man. You've heard of the Power 9? Here's the Power 3. Hello. Oh, okay. Anyone ask about Drillbird today? Yeah, I don't know, like a thousand, like a thousand people. Like, a, like about a thousand a year. I've already passed on two. <laughs> Hi, honey. You guys, Mr. Dinosaur? Whoa, look at this. Let's give it a try. Hi, honey. You guys going to go to the park? That's awesome. Can you show Chad Mr. Dinosaur? Here, I'll pick you up for a second. Here you go. Can you hold it up? Oh, that's a new ten dollar bill. Mr. Dinosaur. Can you say this is Mr. Dinosaur? Ah, you can be shy. <laughs> that's okay. You're you're not here just to perform. That's Daddy's job. Okay, bye-bye. 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 Drill bird. The drill bird is real. Okay, double laser, double laser, double laser. So true, double laser. We've heard no one can defeat the power of the quad laser. The bullet is enormous. There is no escape. Now's the time. Okay, we're going to get a little deeper. Then we're going to probe. Why am I probing? We found the mother load already. If we save for two waves, I bet we can get the double laser for the first time ever. What shirt are you wearing? It says Disney Cruise Lines on it. I'm not even like, I'm not afraid to say it. I enjoyed my cruise immensely. And I, I wear the merch, I mean, two out of seven days weekly. I got two Disney Cruise shirts. I, I wear, they're, they're quick in the rotation. That's not something like I wait till laundry day to wear. What can I say? They know how to do hospitality. You wearing socks? I'm wearing I'm wearing Ketchikan Alaska socks, but that's more of like they're just the first pair I happened to find this morning. I got I've got a limited amount of respect for the socks because they are, this is probably my sixth time wearing this pair of socks and they're already breaking. Now I'm not saying I don't have like a you know I put unusual stresses on my socks. I guess I got big feet and I walk a lot and I slide on the floor like Tom Cruise in Risky Business, but these are also like pure garbage socks. Like they're, they're made for the... You buy the sock to look at it, not to actually wear it. That's the, that's the sad truth of these Ketchikan Alaska tourist socks, I'm sorry to say. Go ahead, make my day. Two more. That's all we need. We just need two more. This is uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger in Kindergarten Ta in Kindergarten Cop. <laughs> so I'm not going there. It was almost a, a, an absolutely horrible Freudian slip, okay? Now, I did not charge my probe. I should have. But it's okay. We just need to find one iron. One, one iron deposit. It's not a tumor. You put the cookie down now. Me calling a, a pizza place as a 14-year-old? Who is your daddy and what does he do? 
water. It's, a, it's still a good resource. Like, it's not what I want, but it's still good. Come on. Come on. Come on. I mean, it's like, we're not asking for the world here. We're asking for a single square of iron. Turns out, yeah, yeah, you're not wrong. Turns out we could we could have really used that probe. We gotta go back up. But just first. Okay, now we really gotta go. Any lore masters that can explain why he pronounces uh, water differently sometimes. Hey, any clinical psychologist that could explain to the streamer why the viewer cares? <clears throat> okay, hold on. I'm gonna let you handle them. I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna enjoy my invincibility. I'm gonna enjoy it. I'm gonna pop it once more. I need help. I need help. I'm gonna die. This is the hardest wave I've ever seen in my life. It's an insanely difficult wave. Never mind, we're we're kind of fine. Thank you, stun laser. But that is sucked pretty bad. We we just need the iron, man. We need two iron. Probe is charged, okay. Why am I going so deep? You don't need to go this deep. You've taken a very circuitous path to get down here. Okay, now just get in the bowels and probe. Thank you. That's that's that could be the edge of a mother load right there. If it's triangles, I'm okay with that. Water was literally like the only resource that would be bad to get here. High quality H2O. You have unmined iron in the top right. I don't know if I'm going to get a chance to, to check that, but... Please! I mean, this is heavy. Like, we like we could do a serious gadget investment, man. Like, I, the next iron deposit we find will probably have five to six. We need two. I feel like we can definitely spend three to upgrade our, our stun laser to have a better chance of surviving this wave. Hey, where's my unmined iron? Where's my unmined iron? Oh, oh, sorry. Looks like you mined it while I wasn't looking at the screen. No, apology accepted. You ever hear of the theory of mind? Anyway. Here we are. We're waiting. This sucks. It's a bad wave. No, never mind. The timing was actually pitch perfect too. Yeah, my theory is the iron gun mines. I think that's a good theory, honestly. Seems like a good one to me. Plus two. Easy wave. Easy wave. That was easy. Okay, into the bowels a little. Nicer substrate, please. Okay, triangles are all... I'm never going to complain about finding some triangulars, but... Life is pain. Never mind, we found it anyway. Are you hyped for the upcoming municipal elections in Vancouver? I already voted. I I, I did my psycho ballot on... Uh, it's one short. We're one short. We're one short. I gotta drop a triangle, but I can't drop a triangle. They're too close to me. It's all right. We got three triangles. That gives us the ability to save for one more round for sure. Um. Yeah, I already, I already voted. 
And I do, I, listen, I was like, it, it was advanced polling, but it was literally like a huge gym that I voted in. And I was the only, there were like eight election officials and then two people uh, work in the ballot box and then like 16 sections where you could vote. And I was the only person in the whole thing. Like, I think it's, uh, <laughs> I think the voter turnout for this election is probably going to be a, a little low. I sh you're right, I should have shot a free throw after. I, I, I didn't even think, they didn't have like the basketball hopper out there. You know what I'm talking about. Those weird like uh, shelves with a bunch of basketballs on them. Okay, we can't get hit by the stone. So if we have to, if we have to invincibility, then we invincibility. The wave wasn't too horrible. Ah! What are your thoughts on the concept of free will? I think there are those who just as have that. I, I will choose free. Da, na, 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 na. You can find the something, something, some celestial voice. If you choose not to decide, you still have made a choice. Where the hell was my iron? Kick that son of a bitch bison's ass so hard. The next bison wannabe will feel it. We gotta take these. Okay, this is laser and then econ. I didn't see you on the ballot, so I just voted for Drake. Well, honestly, it could be worse. You could have voted for Colleen Hardwick. <laughs> Am I right, fellow Vancouverites, in favor of increased densification in the city? So true. So that, that, that joke is so local that even the Vancouverites are like, I don't really get it. I didn't realize how politically polarizing you are. It's not polarizing. My audience primarily consists of millennials. Being like pro housing density is like the least controversial issue of all time. I only have like controversial opinions about jaywalking, really. Okay, so, 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 the double, wait, I'm no, yeah, there you go, double laser, that's the one. We finally got it. I also would like to get laser auto-aim. Six degrees is kind of a lot, but maybe we got other stuff we could work on first. Like, increased probe would be nice, cheaper stun laser, health. <laughs> That two probes is good too, but I think we need econ before we need the two probes. Look, I'm going to take a cheap stun laser upgrade. Whoa, dude! Whoa! Oh, wait, I can... Immediately I can understand the value of the double laser. When enemies are on the ground, especially. Wow, that makes like a huge difference. POV, first, you're the first person on Earth to use windshield wipers. I'm going to plus two that joke. I thought that was really funny. Guy using windshield wipers for the first time. <laughs> are you seeing this? This is amazing. We don't probe yet. You gotta, you gotta get deep in the bowels first. There you go. Then you get down here. Okay, this is a, a it's a nasty ass substrate. Let's pop it. There is something right there. Oh man, D drill speed, drill speed next. We're we're pretty deep. We need this drill speed. We need like four iron to get it. I should really just buy the inventory uh, UI sometimes. If you were in the chess boxing tournament, do you think you would buy, you would focus more on the boxing or the chess? I would focus more on the boxing, without a doubt. 
Don't you do like a round of boxing for like every six moves or something like that? I feel like you could just learn to play some very every three minutes? Oh my god! Are you playing on three minutes per clock or like three minutes total? Total? How much time do you get on your clock overall? Like, I'm not trying to just game it. I'm just saying, couldn't you be like, oh, I'm really thinking hard about uh, round one? Or like, I'm really thinking, oh, I don't know which line of the Sicilian I want to play. And then you, you're like, you're guaranteed like at least three rounds of boxing, right? I feel like if you got insanely good at, uh, at boxing for an amateur, like a, a complete novice, and then you... Uh, just focused on playing draw openings, like, you're gonna stomp them. You can get checkmated early. No, no international master is getting checkmated on, like, move eight. Put the chess book down and, and start working on your footwork, man. Okay, we got eight of these. What was I thinking we needed next? Econ. We need drill speed. We need drill speed. So be it. I sweat. Imagine what the auto aim could do for us, though. A GM just got beaten in 10 moves at the US Chess Championship? Yeah, and there's a reason it's on the news. It's because that shit does not happen very often. His anal probe must have malfunctioned. Is that what you want me to say? Is that what you want me to say? That his anal probe must have malfunctioned? You want me to say, oh, his blue... Dude, with me when I'm 60 moves deep versus Magnus Carlsen and my I hear my anus say, battery low. Me when I'm up six centipons on Magnus in the World Championship, and then a little voice in my butt says, Battery low. <laughs> it's the same joke? I'm trying to improve it, okay? The first one was merely a draft. Huge. Huge. That's a good one. Well, now we're just, now we're just doing nothing. You know what? Well, we're here. Quality of life mining. Sure, sure, sure. Don't know what I expected. Sorry, I just thought you guys might want to change sides just for a second there. Focus yourself on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, they're still getting a little nasty with it. Still pretty annoying. better getting reflection with double laser seems insane it might ha has he lost his mind can he see but is he blind you how would you get the it's a different dome these are two different domes you're referring to here just so you know reflection is only for the sword dome whoops my bad you you fucking troll I think I don't see right. You're not an intellectual. Get back here. Oh, the uh, the the reflectability. Okay, I see what you're talking about now. I take back my comments about you living under a bridge and asking people three riddles if they want to cross it. I 
I apologize. Apologizing is great. By the way, in case you're like one of those people who's allergic to apologizing, I would really recommend n not being that guy. Um, apologizing is great because you can really like be out of the pocket as long as you're quick with your apologies. You can just say whatever pops into your head as long as you're quick to say sorry. That's what I've noticed. Probe me? Nothing, huh? No from all four? Oh, never mind. I'll put down my iron. Joke's on you, I got another frickin' iron. Tell me you're Canadian without telling me you're Canadian? Did you see the new maple fudge brownie? Have you had the new blueberry lemon muffin from Second Cup? Yeah, it's pretty good. I want to fly faster. Better shield would be kind of sick too, though. Ooh, I don't know. But you know what else would be sick? Maybe we'll go auto. Maybe we'll, we only need five more iron to get the auto swiveler. I think we should give it a try. We haven't reached our pivot yet. Okay, can I get the stun laser to help me here? I went in the wrong direction. Stun laser, stun laser, keep it up, keep it up. Keep it up, please. You know what, I have, I have at least one invincib invincibility left. Wait for it. Ah, no, no need. No need. You suck. I said good day, sir. Is second cup better than Tim Hortons? The extremely Vancouver snobby voice. Um, the only coffee chain I go to these days is JJ Bean. We should, we should one trip this. I'll take one lick. You're my one trip. Always. I know, seven iron, wee wee woe, keeping, waiting, it's come in, sorry. <laughs> A lot of people have asked me how I feel about the Blink-182 reunion. I gotta tell you, in all honesty, I had no idea that they were gone. I didn't know that they broke up as a band. I did know that the one guy was doing Alien podcasts. Mathis? Well, I'm not surprised. If you told me that it's Tom, right? If you told me Tom DeLong was on uh, Chiluminati, I would say, I, I believe you. I would say, I bet. We, we don't have a ton of time, so I'm using a suboptimal probe, okay? There could still be a triangle in here. Nope. 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 Okay, this is not efficient. You still have iron on the left? Oh, you mean in Moria? Just wait for it. Okay, I want to see some auto swivels here. Let's see what six degrees can truly mean. I'm gonna invincibility on that one. Overlord's gotta go, dude. This doesn't seem that bad. And our shield is still full. We're actually fine. We'll get an invulnerability. Yeah, no sweat. Is it swiveling at all? I think it's swiveling. It just doesn't have like a great, uh, like a, a visual indicator. Didn't even charge my probe. What was I thinking? Some iron, right? You were right. Are there any American cities you'd never visit? Oh, yes. Absolutely. Next question. Buffalo? 
Listen, I would not have a problem visiting Buffalo if it was on the way. You think I would? I'm not going to turn up my nose at a beef on weck sandwich. I wish you just... What was? Did they put something in your caraway seeds this, this week? Why is Buffalo getting so riled up? I don't hate Buffalo. I've got nothing against it. It's just like, you know, you're no Toronto. No disrespect. If Toronto was... If, if I had to drive through Buffalo to get to Toronto, I would have stopped in Buffalo. I would have got gas there, okay? And then I would have fueled up. We're still on this? People keep ringing the bell! You know what? Give me. St have you heard of Strength 2, Pippin? Actually, our shield was more than strong enough there. I, I think the two probes, yes, but also Stun Laser. Ah, oh, but we could really use Econ. Eh, whatever. You know what? Not spending triangles on healing is Econ in and of itself. Hockey season just started and the Kings have already disappointed beyond belief. How do you deal with having a shitty team? Uh, I don't know, maybe like console yourself with the two Stanley Cups you've won in the past decade? Like, what's wrong with you? It's, and also like, just relax, you're one game into the season? Like, did we really ship Canucks great Alex Edler over to the Kings just so he could be like crapped on for being 39 years old and like not as good as uh, Kale McCarr. Like they just is disrespectful. Quite for there's like they what they were like one game into the season. Just relax. Just chill out. Wasn't even that bad. Plus, I, there is a, I, and I see it happen on the Canucks subreddit. At some point, you've got to, um, okay, grow up is maybe not the word that I should use. At some point, you have to recognize that it's just sports. Maybe that's a better way to describe it. <clears throat> it's unbecoming of an adult to let their mental state be dictated by the success or failure of a sports team. It's not to say you can't, you know, enjoy it and be like a diehard fan or whatever, but you should like, at the very least, don't let your emotional state be determined by the result of a regular season sports game. You know, the, the people on the team don't even know who you are. Just watch it for entertainment. If you're not entertained, turn it off. Watch the next one. That's, that's my advice. Would love to know your thoughts. Okay, now I'll double probe. Now I'll double probe. It's just the sport is such a weak mindset. That is true. And you know what? He's right. I don't understand why they have kickers that just miss kicks. Like, it's you literally had one job, Lemon. A mother load. Okay, now we know for next time. That's pretty close to the surface. Ah! Honestly, like one of the best things for me about putting the Canucks in perspective was going to see uh, Canucks games. And then, you know, you pay money for like a ticket and then they lose and you're like, oh, right. Like, I, I don't live in a storybook. You got to learn how to have fun with the with it, even when your team doesn't get the result you're looking for. Some, sometimes that means like, hey, you're watching the kiss cam for half the game because it's the most exciting thing going. Unfortunately, but it is what it is. Dude, that was pretty good. You ever been on the Kiss Cam? I haven't, but in uh, in Korea, I went to a Busan I Park K League game against Tegu FC, and. Um, I was, because we were the only foreigners in the audience, they put us on the 
camera on the Jumbotron, I should say, and we won like two Pizza Hut personal pizzas that they delivered to us in the in the stands. It's true. Insanely lucky. I mean, plus, like, we were in Busan anyway, just as, like, a trip. And then going to see a K-League game is, like, under $20. So we actually probably made money by getting free lunch. It was a, it was a money-making endeavor. But we had to watch 90 minutes of soccer. Boo! We were, we were plus twoing you. And then you insulted the, the world's favorite game. I, I actually like soccer. I just, I can't resist. I can't resist the call of the void. We need carrying capacity. We do. But there was something else that was, that was rattling around in the old dome that I was thinking about. Oh, health would be nice at some point too, I guess. I mean, you know what I'm already going to say. Like, we, we basically just need a teleporter. Okay. <laughs> Multiplier? Yeah, sure. I guess our score is 44. That's a good point. Should get auto heal? Good one. Hold on. Your ass has got to go. This is a nasty wave. This is a nasty wave with it, bro. Wait for it. Beautiful. You gotta go. You gotta go. Little swivel. There's a little swivel in there. Anything? Bueller? Bueller? A little any any Buellers in the audience tonight? There's more iron down there. What am I thinking? Well, I guess I'm taking a circuitous route, aren't I? That's my secret cap. I'm always circuitous. I'm gonna drop one. I think we have to buy carrying capacity when it takes us so long to get here. We need to make it worth our while. Soccer's not popular in North America because they can't put ads on the screen every 10 seconds. It's like an actual plus two joke if the every soccer jersey wasn't like little team logo and then huge ad on every single shirt. Qantas! Etihad Airways. The whole, the whole thing is ad driven. It's even called the Barclays Premier League. Or at least it was. We have five and two. I definitely feel like it's still the right time to invest. I don't think I'm an overcharger, though, so I think it's the wrong time to invest. But the hockey ads are getting crazy. I, if you don't follow hockey, you might be unfamiliar with the current controversy surrounding the ads. You've got to be specific about which controversy you're talking about these days. Um, they've, there's ads on the boards, you know, those, those areas on the side of the screen. Um, which is, that's been the case forever, but they've decided, hey, you know, we're broadcasting Vancouver Canucks games, but people in Toronto are watching them. How are they supposed to be able to take advantage of all these local businesses that are advertising on the boards? So they like green screen them, like chroma keyed them, maybe is a good way to describe it. And then they digitally impose ads on the, on the national broadcasts now. Um, which it is really, um, hold on, life's hard. It's a bad idea in principle, I think, and a worse idea in practice. Because, like, the sport moves so fast, the camera's constantly moving very quickly. The, the players keep glitching through the board ads, so like the ads are in front of the players sometimes. It's, 
It's just not good. <clears throat> it's not it's not working out well and people are upset. Plus like they you got to if if you're going to boil a frog in a pot of water, you got to do it slowly, right? This year they also added a uh, jersey sponsor, so we're slowly becoming you know, uh, soccer as well. Where the jerseys are going to have ads on them. Like, you can't add jersey advertisements and digitally imposed board advertisements in the same year. There was, like, a helmet ads got added, like, two years ago. Like, they're, they're coming in a little too fast, man. I'm like, I'm boiling. I'm boiling, Gary Bedman. I'm boiling. Not to mention all the uh, the gambling ads. Come on, come on. I want you to trip me, come on. Like every ad on TV is Jesse Pinkman being like, I bet the over, bitch. Only a bitch bets the under. What did I want, Sky? I wanted better shield capacity, yes. And some score. Yeah, you know what? You're not wrong there on the score front. So let's get uh, let's get two triangles going on score. And you know what? I will invest two, then four iron on score as well, just to start amping it up a little bit. Hubris? We still have two triangles left. I saved two triangles. Walt, you're the smartest science teacher I ever had. You're too stupid to realize he already is betting at MGMGrand.com, the only Canadian online casino in Ontario that allows you to do 17-way parlays. Do get it twisted. You will get rich. Okay, give me my super fruit, please. My super fruit? My super fruit? Yum. Yum brands. I see why they named the brand so nice they named it right. That's gotta be water triangles. Probably water. Definitely water. But you know what? That's a pretty good haul, dude. We work for a hockey company. Contractually, we aren't allowed to bet, so we're safe. I get that you're being sarcastic, and I think that that's very funny. <laughs> I am, like, a little anti-gambling, but at the same time, I think it's... Um, let me let me be careful with this one because I don't know the whole story. But you know what? If I'm wrong, I'll just apologize. So it's fine. Um, if Pete Rose wasn't betting on his own games, who cares? Shouldn't he be in? The, I'm not saying he's a he's a good guy, but isn't he like the best baseball player of all time? And he was. It, if if they could not prove that he was betting on his own games, and there's no suspicion. I guess there's obviously going to be some suspicion, but even if he shouldn't bet on his own games, but as long as he only bet on his team to win, then even then, I don't think that's necessarily a cause for him not to be in the, the Hall of Fame. We can take lift. You might as well take lift, but I'm, I'm still waiting for a teleporter. Isn't he the... You're going to tell me Pete Rose isn't the best baseball player of all time? Isn't he Mr. 3000? Didn't they base Mr. 3000 on Pete Rose?
It's a bit of a hell wave, yeah. Thank you, stun laser. Zap him. Can you zap him? Quick zap. He's done. He's done. We got on him fast enough. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Oh. Zoomy. Easy wave. Plus we got two triangles. Honestly, I'm kind of stoked we should be like closer to the edge over here. Like, yes. Like the band, yes. By the way, I recently, I, I said something I'd like to take back about the band, yes. Which is that I am, oh, I didn't probe myself. Oh my god. Um, I said yes has to have one of the widest gulfs between their good songs and their bad songs. The song I used as a, as a, an example of a bad song was I've seen all good people. This caused a, a flurry of minus twos in chat. And I would like to apologize because I've heard it more recently. I thought that I've seen all good people was just the part that goes, I've seen all good people that their heads and I didn't realize that it was also the guy, uh, um, you know, when he does like the, the, the folk part. You know what I mean? Yeah, I agree. Health, health would be a great pickup here. The bluesy part sucks. Wrong. The, the, in, in, I've seen all good people. It's the bluesy part that is good. Well, not bluesy, but like, um, folky. I like when he goes a little Stonehenge on it. When he goes a little Stonehenge on its ass. Okay, we're going up. What was the good song in the example? I mean, there's so many. The one I always default to is Close to the Edge. I think it's, it's one of my favorite songs of all time. Roundabout, great song. Owns. Ah! Uh, acceptable! Acceptable use of your resources! Hold on, this wave actually was not that bad. That was a completely fine wave. Siberian Katru, also great. Also a great... I mean, close to the edge, the, the album itself is, is just... Uh, it's an exceptional album. I'm helping my lift out. Me helping my lift driver. You can just park anywhere. This is good. This is huge. Look at look at how thin this substrate is. Okay, now probe me. Let's go. Long distance, mother load. Long distance, vein full of water. What the heck? It was it was bubbling like crazy. Where the heck was my? It's down further. Who said up? Get audited. Ah, okay. That's that's the that's correct. It's, it's fucking thick with it, dude. I gotta go back up. We'll try to get it on the lift next time. We should definitely invest in the lift speed. It's very cheap. What does the lift do? Very little. Causes arguments would be like the big one. Keeper lift speed 20, okay. You go up so early? That's very true, you can look at the wave timer. I had enough time to, to break at least one more square while I was down there. You never know, that could have made all the difference. 
Okay, I think, uh, what are we at at triangles wise? Two. We're chilling. You gotta go first. Can you pop up, please? You're driving me crazy. You're okay, you're okay. I think my first invulnerability pop was not as good as it could have been, but now we're feeling better. You gotta go. You gotta go. We have we have one more invulnerability auto popping. It's just gonna take time. It's gonna take time. One's still alive. There you are. I didn't realize. Wait, more is still alive? I see your ass. Okay. We lived. Okay, we are, we're running down for the mother load, but first I'm going to get my, my, my mine fruit. There's no wither on laser dome. You're so close. You're almost, I know that's condescending to say, you're almost there. The wither is not connected uh, to, the, to the dome type, it's connected to the gadget type. Two very, very different situations. Now you guys, if you could do me a favor and just get in the lift. That way you're gonna come to the surface, albeit incredibly slowly. And we can take these ones up ourselves. There you go. Ooh, not bad. Little better. Go get him. So true. I think we need to buy health so our triangles go further. We got a, a little time, but not much. Does the lift suck less if you upgrade it? Yeah, but like here's the wow. Who would have thought? Um, here's something that that it, it'll mess with you mentally speaking. I very rarely take the lift early because of the fact that. Um, I'm going even deeper on it because I think it's not a, a premier gadget and by the time it shows up I think it tends to be a little less worth investing in so it's all it's a self-fulfilling prophecy but you gotta remember there's there's trade-offs for everything in this game Upgrading your lift always, by necessity, comes at the expense of upgrading something else. Hey, we might be dead. Or at least harmed. Never mind. Seems like we're fine. Could use some triangles but but even before we need the triangles like iron is the engine that runs the run iron is the color of your energy so i've been riding a lot of peloton lately why not that's probably water that might be the edge of a mother load it's a triangle now that is surprising to me Drop those in there. It's going to take a while for it to come to the surface, but it is what it is. Where? Oh, there! Bam. 
That shit ain't moving, dog. True, true. That's pretty true. We should just take some of this up to the surface. We haven't got time. Thank you. Go up in the lift. If I went up in the lift, I would get back too fast. You would yell at me. So instead, I'm taking my sweet time, so it looks like I used my time as, as close... I, used, I did the most efficient mining possible. Okay, we got 14 of those. I would really rather... Dissolve projectiles sounds kind of sick with it, dude. And I do think we need, like, more defense. We don't have enough water to do a gadget upgrade, so I'm, this is an eco round in my world. Hold on. It's just a... I'm focused. I'm focused. I'm a people person. The engineers don't know how to deal with people. I'm going two triangles. It could have been a lot worse. You didn't use invulnerability, you psycho. Yeah, yeah, you're right about that. Not wrong. Your lift is jammed, brother? How does that even... How does that happen? My elevator's jammed. My battery is low. Just so you know. We're going to a place nearby. Gotta go. One guy is jamming the chat, actually. Okay, well, apparently one guy's jamming the chat. That I did not know. Battery low, screen cracked, vibing, living my best life. Look, it's not jammed. Look at that, it's going. I'm telling you, the, the, the lift by default is so ass. And I said by default, okay? By default is so ass that it looks broken when it's working. Nothing, okay? The, the mine is bone dry. That's something. Could be the start of a mother load. Is the start of a mother load? I can do two more tiles, then I'm out. I can do... Come on. You get, no, I'm, a, I'm gone. <laughs> Too much greed. We're going to be real quick up here, but it's still... Here, let me help you. We lost a couple on the way, but you know what? We gained a couple on the way, too. We need to get to 30. Holy cow. We're still on a save round. That's scary. UPS drivers with my package. Good joke. A uh, plus to the chat on that one. Any chance those triangles made it up? Any luck catching them triangles then? Oh, that's right. It is just the one triangle, actually. Whoa. Hold on. Easy. <clears throat> Simple, unbothered, living my best life. What are we at? 147. <laughs> Where's my mother load, though? 
We we didn't we go up from where where was the mother load? I can't find it. Must have been more to the right. They need to have signs. This is the the real power of the teleporter. Is in allowing you to figure out where you just were. That's your brain. Hold on. All caps, that's your brain. Knife underscore F5 aquamarine text. Okay, carry on. Talk amongst yourselves. I'm, I'm visualizing your name and the color of your of your font here. You know what? I'm just going up. Please, I'm normally rather polite. Okay, sorry I made you be so impolite. You fucking psycho! What are you talking about? Jeffrey Dahmer also normally didn't murder people. He did kill like 20 people. But like, if you think about the fact that he was alive for like 20,000 days, there was only like, like one one thousandth of his life where he was committing murders. Okay, we're dissolving projectiles. One more, one more. I'm going laser speed. I'm going, that was a huge mother load, man. Dissolves projectiles. Uh, no kidding. Ain't that the truth. You know what? <laughs> bit of a bit of a tough wave still. In spite of the dissolving projectiles, still pretty tough. We got one triangular. Thank you for your help. You're bringing, I appreciate you bringing those up. You're too good to me. You really are. You're not wrong. Get, getting some triangles, we hit the spot right now. Maybe we move ourselves closer to the edge of the map. Of the map. Get yourself a little closer to the edge here. But on the same, by the same token, we need um, drill speed. So I actually think we should mine up a little bit. Maybe like over here. Triangles plus a mother load, maybe? Water. Oop, just gonna scooch right by ya. Me at the grocery store, just trying to buy a can of beans. There's uh, someone in there for 20 minutes trying to decide if they really need those beans. Just gonna sneak right by you there. Here's how you do it. You see, you just grab it. See, you're looking for, you're looking for kidney beans. What you're gonna do, you grab, you're gonna gra grab these ones. They say Haricot Rouge on them. You're just gonna, that's how you just put it in your cart right there. And then you got nothing to worry about. You got nothing to worry about until you go up, and then you're gonna have to scan them, and then you're gonna have to pay them a little bit. You're gonna have to pay them a little bit of, just all that for a little bit of money. We're still doing this bid? Yes, it's been two days. You're still eating chicken nuggets for dinner five times a week, and it's been 30 years. Why do you hold me to different standards than you hold yourself to? Seems a little bit sus, Walt. I love when you just... Being mean in response to sarcasm and then seeing everybody pog up. Um, it's, it's, a, it's a seductive feeling, man. It's too much. Let me get even faster stun laser. 
There's something wrong with my brain that that's like the best feeling. It, it, is, it is a dangerous high. Because it, it can easily make you think that like the world is out to get you. But you can't stop me because I'll just make fun of you. But when it works, it feels damn good. Everybody's been there, and I don't mean on vacation. After years of not punching down, I can't imagine the thrill. I mean, that's an insult to suggest that me responding to a chatter is punching down. I consider it punching laterally. I don't know. It could be, for all I know, there could be many Fortune 500 CEOs watching right now who have a good work-life balance and are not complete psychos. Wrong. Gotcha! We're your boss? Okay. Let, let's figure out who's the boss. Uh, I'm not coming into work on Monday. How, what's your response? You're fired? Mm, no, I don't think so. I think I'll be here on Tuesday. I think I'll get paid. So tell me again who's the boss. Good one. I'm fired? Good one. I'll see you on Tuesday. Isn't a boss supposed to have some, some form of uh, power? Some control? We said hired. Oh, okay. Well, you know, I'll see you. I know it starts at 9. Maybe I'll roll in around 9.05. It depends. You know, I got some busy stuff going on in the morning sometimes. It's a little bit uh, unpredictable. You do that anyway? Yeah, I know. Even though you're the boss. It's a, it's a very funny thing. Very humorous. Is he lift pilled now? No, I still hate the lift. Um, the the thing I like ab about the lift is the fact that it doesn't take up a gadget spot. So it is like great in the sense that it's free. It is doing something. I think we need drill speed. If to stay alive here, we need econ. We need drill speed. Is it better than two heels? I would. I, I think it is. I, I genuinely think it is, and I, I didn't uh, two days ago. <laughs> Today I do, though. It's all good until Chad unionizes. What are you talking? It's like saying like the McDonald's customers are going to unionize. What, what does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. Ah! Sometimes the fries are not salty enough. Is it so much to ask that we always get salty fries? Like I don't, I don't know if you can, I don't know if you can unionize for that. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about, but you do really sometimes low roll the French fries, though. There's no doubt about that. Hey, get on. Thank you. Dang, we're still alive. 16. We're looking for 20. 99% of the salt goes to 1% of the fries? Actually true, though. I hate when you have to wait a little bit for your food and then the fries are also unsalted. You're like, what the hell have I been waiting for, man? This is an outrage. I'm not going to complain about it. Again, like, you know, your life's... I'm, this sounds dismissive. I don't mean to say your life's hard enough you work at McDonald's. I just mean to say, like, you know, I'm not going to be the kind of person raising a stink in a McDonald's over... My, my french fries are not uh, good enough. Uh, but, you know, sometimes I'm like, damn, I wish these french fries were a little bit better. But then again, I'm at McDonald's. What did I expect?
My beard hurts. What sauce do you get at McDonald's? Can I tell you, last time I went to McDonald's with my parents, I ordered on the kiosk, right? I wanted to get a Coke Zero. Holy cow. It said Coke Zero was only available in a child's size. So I said, I guess, okay, I'll get a Coke Zero. My mom puts in her order. She says Diet Coke. They got all the sizes available. I go back and change my order so that it says, like, do I, I change my Coke Zero to a Diet Coke because they're the same beverage, fundamentally speaking. I should go up. Um... And then, the craziest part of all, when we got our food, they just gave us cups. They did, it's not like they had like a, a reservoir in the back and they filled the drinks for us. They just gave us cups and sent us to the fountain, where I then got Coke Zero, because like, there, there was enough Coke Zero in the fountain to pour. I was like, what the hell's going on here? They were, they were sold out of... Large, medium, and small Coke Zeros. I don't know why in my head, I guess I trust the technology too much. Like, I thought uh, maybe the kiosk is hooked up to the fountain drinks so that you they can keep an accurate inventory of how much supply is left in it. In hindsight, that's very stupid, I guess. Okay, we gotta get in on this guy right here. This seems bad. I've already used my invulnerability! I'm gonna have to heal. I'm gonna have to heal? Um, yep. Okay, just do it right now. You got two triangles. Heal yourself. Heal yourself up off your feet. Dude, I'm just being real with you, and this is people are not ready for this. I think we have to go all in on score. I think we're in like a death spiral right now. We we have to bank some score for the believers. I'm sorry to say. I think it's true. What's the streamer's favorite Sunset Rubdown album? Um, Random Spirit Lover, for sure. I mean, Mending of the Gown is in the rotation to this day. If not Random Spirit Lover, I do love that the, that first record that has stadiums... Uh, track for Debut album, side one, track one. Spencer Krug's like, this song's called Stadiums and Shrines 2. What the heck? You could do that? I didn't know you could do that. Great song, though. Have you listened to any 2022 album? I don't believe so, no. I don't, I don't think so. Where is it? It's Triangles. I think the most recent album I listened to was the Japanese Breakfast album. And I'm not talking about a randomly generated Instagram photo set. That's 2021? Yeah, that's why it's the most recent album I listened to. Okay, I'm going I'm going full into score here. Album Japan. I don't know. It makes me laugh every time. I'm so predictable. I'm so messed up. I'm so fricked up. I mean, you know what? I heard it recently came with an additional lifting orb. Check the left side. I got a good feeling about it. Okay, well, you know what? I will. I said I'd go score. I was not lying to you. I see it. I see you on me. I see you on me.
Chill, chill. Richard Lewis voice, it's the wave from hell. I've come to terms with it, I've come to terms with it. As a hell, I think we were too slow. That was maybe our best laser run ever. We got to 219 score. Oh, Malv's got a pretty good one now. Wildcat Max, thanks for the gifted subscriptions, by the way. Thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Malv's climbing the charts, man. Sorry, I'm just stretching. That's a good score with laser plus lift. I think, like, I mean, I'm just being honest. Teleporters, like, it's a must-have. Hey, Knife F5, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Thank you. With no teleporters, like, we, we're capped a little bit. It's just so good. 